Israel's beautiful Mediterranean coastline is today's stop as we visit the Roman ruins of Caesarea. Ruben is taking us to the famous Roman aqueduct to start our tour. Shalom. This aqueduct brings water from some springs south of Zichron Yaakov, maybe more than 20 miles away, to the Imperial Roman capital of Caesarea. It's more than 2,000 years ago. It was built by Herod the Great when he built the new capital of the Roman Empire here in Caesarea. Here we are at one of those great projects of Herod. This is a hippodrome, horse racing. You know, in all horse racing stadiums, they have win, place, and show. That all comes from here. Herod wanted more and more participants. This was like the Olympics. Sports and games were not only circuses and food, but they were the way of Hellenism. And the more people that came to the games here made him more of a, a, a personality in the Roman world that he wanted to be. So he started placing show. He offered people money for second and third. It's the first time it's ever done. So they had between four and eight chariots, and each chariot had two or four horses. And they would go down to that very end make a sharp turn, you remember like the movie of Ben-Hur, come back. And they did it about eight times. And this is a theater that Herod built for 12,000 people more than 2,000 years ago. And it's the opposite of everything Jewish. Herod's personal values were the opposite of everything Jewish. He was Roman, he was Hellenistic. He had theaters, he had gladiators, he was away from the spiritual. While well, he builds this great temple in Jerusalem, here he builds a temple almost as great to Zeus. Let's go and look at this theater. This theater is still in use today. Concerts are held here. It's been used for 2,000 years, and it's been renovated many times. After the Roman period, the Byzantine and Christian period, theater wasn't so important. They were going back to the spiritual instead of the physical values. So the theater really became in disuse. There was an immense building here in the Roman period, so you didn't see the ocean. This is the center of the Roman world in Israel. Herod built this around 9 before the common era and he dedicated. This was the great capital in the eastern Mediterranean. He built a port here that was the largest port between Alexandria and Rome. And he used maritime cement. He poured cement that solidified new water. It's the first time maritime cement was ever used. Uve, thanks a lot. I and everybody, I'm sure, really enjoyed the tour.